Uh, this is uh, the July BAM box. BAM box. Uh, and if it's anything like the June box, this box is going to be incredible. This has instantly become my favorite box. Um, I've been a big fan of it. Uh, and then I got my first box last month and I absolutely loved it. Um, I'm a huge, huge, huge supporter of the BAM box people. And guys, they are so appreciative of the people who do these videos and, and whatnot. Um, I will put a picture on the thing. Uh, they actually it, it put a picture of little old me. Little old me with like 40 some subscribers. Uh, they put me on their website, my video uh, featured on their website in videos. Such an amazing honor um, to be included and with uh, my friends over at Comic Trips and uh, uh, the uh, fine folks at uh, Nerd Therapy. Uh, those guys are awesome channels. Uh, you should check them out as well. Wedged in between those two uh, was, was my video and I am so incredibly honored, so incredibly grateful. Uh, I'm not getting anything from Bambox. I'm not receiving any kind of a plug to, to talk about how great they are or anything like that. I bought this box with my own money um, and uh, I love it and uh, they are so supportive of the people that uh, do this uh, so I can't even begin to thank them enough. Uh, the things it's done for my channel, my viewers, uh, my subscribers doubled. Uh, I got like triple the amount of viewers on that video that I've gotten uh, that I had gotten already uh, just because of their support and I appreciate every uh, ounce of it. Um, so uh, if you have not checked this box out yet, you really should. Uh, the next month's box is probably already on the verge of being sold out and uh, there's still a couple weeks to go uh, on that one. So um, definitely uh, want to say thank you and want to just once again say you should really subscribe to this box. I haven't even opened this box and I already think that uh, it's going to be amazing just because of what they put into it, the time and effort that goes into these boxes. Um, far and away, whatever they're doing there, they're doing it right, and, um, and I love it. So, this is the July box. The theme is Galaxy or Galactic or something along those lines. It's all space stuff. Um, I'm worried that this is going to be a little bit above my head because I'm not a big space person. I don't, uh, I don't really get into space too much. So, hopefully, uh, hopefully I will know everything that is in this box and not look like a complete moron. So let's get this box opened up. Also, I want to point something else out. This box came two-day mail. All of these other subscription boxes, every single one of them comes uh, Smart Post Economy, which takes about a week or so to get. This box arrives within two days. Um, and that is, I mean, that's just another thing that they're doing. They're really shows how much they care. They're even making sure that we're getting these boxes as quickly as possible. Um, I was away last week uh, and my box has uh, been sitting in my room for the last week. Uh, I was away at a summer camp for uh, adults with muscular dystrophy that I do every year and um, uh, I, I just, uh, I've, been, I've been eager to get into this thing so let's go ahead and do it. Uh, I also got another box and so you'll be able to look for another video coming shortly. So let's see what's in this month's bam box. Oh, we got some cards. Let's see. Let's see what these cards have to say. It looks like I got one of the precious one-ups. Uh, it looks like I got a gold mushroom one-up or a yellow, yellow, excuse me, I got a yellow one-up card. Uh, the yellow one-up cards mean that one of my items has been upgraded. So uh, everybody's getting a specific item. And one of the items that uh, is in this box uh, is an upgrade. There's a limited quantity of them, and uh, I received one of those limited quantities. So we'll see what that is in a moment. Uh, next month, oh, I'm sorry, uh, another thing that Bambox does is they give, do a giveaway, uh, of a, like an extra awesome item. If you post a picture of yourself uh, with your favorite item from this month's box and you use the hashtag TheBambox, uh, they uh, will be giving away... This looks like it's a Stan Lee signed uh, Ronan the Accuser 16 by 20 photograph. So uh, the winner will be announced in a couple of weeks. Um, so if you have this box, if you haven't already done that, so go ahead and um, tweet your favorite item, uh, hashtag uh, the band box, so you have a chance to win this. Because that has got to be pretty awesome. It's, uh, Stan Lee is, uh, you know, he's Stan Lee. So uh, 
uh, that's that. And then uh, a little uh, straight out of Compton, uh, straight out of Bandbox. Uh, they're really pushing the Bandbox community, uh, which I have joined up with. It's a really cool uh, place where people who subscribe to the Bandbox can go. Um, and uh, one of the things that they've done is they've set up a, a little trade, uh, like a swap and, swap and whatnot. So you can go in there if there's an item in your box that you got that you don't particularly like. Uh, you can go on to the Bandbox community and see if somebody wants to trade uh, for something that they didn't like that maybe you might like. So uh, there you go. All right, so this month's pin is very cool. This is really neat. I love their pins. They're really cool quality and um, really cool designs. This is a Groot, uh, Guardians of the Galaxy Groot pin. And it's in that like old tattoo style where it's got like a little banner thing. And it says true. Uh, and uh, so that is really, really neat. These pins are really great. I, I've been bragging to everybody about these little rubber backings on the pins because I think they're absolutely amazing. Um, and they're so comfortable. So uh, this month's pin is Groot. Uh, a true tattoo style pin. That is really cool. Alright, what else we got? We've got the paper holding everything in place. Nothing in the paper, so we will discard it thusly. And what is this? This is Mars Space Sand. I don't know what that means. Uh, this is, uh, oh, it never gets wet. Uh, this sand, like the Martian soil, is hydrophobic. Uh, it is completely repels water. Uh, so, oh yeah, so this is the kind of stuff that uh, you can like pour into a glass of water and um, you can kind of squish it together and it'll like form into like a ball. But then the second you take it out of the water, it just turns right back into regular sand. So this is really cool. This is an interesting, neat item. Um, kind of goes along with the space theme. Uh, that is really, really cool. Uh, kind of a fun little uh, toy. Um, type thing, something to play with, and you know, kind of real magical looking type of a thing. That's kind of, that's kind of neat. All right, what else do we got here? These appear to be, this is a Star Trek, uh, obviously. Um, and I don't know, it's like the pin that like, um, that uh, what's his face wears on his chest. I can't, maybe this is like a, like a military academy pin or something like that. Um, that's nice. This, is this copper? Seems like it might be copper. This is a really cool, so this is the pin, like I think it's the pin that like it goes on like the uniform. And then um, I'm guessing these little buttons are like the, because didn't uh, Captain uh, Picard had like the, the buttons on his like collar? I'm thinking that that's what these are. Uh, I'm not 100% certain. But uh, I'll check the thing and it'll tell me for sure. Uh, this is pretty nice. They're really nice quality. Um, like I said, I think this might be copper. It's really nice. It's really nice quality. Um, so we got some Star Trek uh, badge pin, military pin thingies, whatever. I don't know. Uh, that's cool. Uh, Let's see, this is an Alien Resurrection Authentic Wardrobe piece. Well, that's neat. So this is a piece of a jacket um, from the movie Alien Resurrection that was worn uh, in the movie. Um, it was worn by one of the cast members. It doesn't really say who or when, but it doesn't really matter. It's kind of like, a, kind of like how baseball cards and football cards, sometimes they cut like little pieces of their jerseys and put them in the, in the baseball cards. Uh, it's something similar along the lines of that. But this is from Alien Resurrection. That is kind of cool. That is kind of a neat little interesting item. Um, yeah. I love the Alien movies. Of course, I am a Predator fan, as you can see. So I was uh, I was on Team Predator uh, for AVP, if you will. Uh, let's see. Here we have a print. It looks like it's number 721 of 199. And it is uh, Sinestro in the Yellow Core um, fighting, let's just say that's uh, Hal Jordan and uh, Green Lantern. Um, kind of in a, like a, you know, looks like, looks like they're uh, arm wrestling. I'm going to beat you, Sinestro, you know. 
Uh, so that's kind of neat. I like the prints that they do. This isn't really on my alley as much as um, like that Slimer was from last month. Um, but this is really kind of a nice... Uh, I've never been a big Green Lantern fan. I guess that goes along with my whole space thing. I'm just not a big space person. But he was a... a he's an OG uh, Green Lantern, uh, OG uh, Jarrett Justice Leader. Alright, what is this? This is... <laughs> that is cool. It's, uh, I guess maybe this is a bookend, or maybe it's just a cutout of some sort, but this is uh, Mr. Darth Vader holding his lightsaber, and this is, uh, you can see that's a good quality uh, metal there. It's just like a little cutout of uh, a good old Darth just hanging, using the force and whatnots, uh, hanging out on the dark side, building Death Stars and whatnots. Um, so that's kind of neat. That is really cool. That's really nice quality. They've done some of these with other stuff before where they've had like the, the cast uh, steel or aluminum or whatever this is uh, before. And this is really, really nice. It's just a, I don't think this is a bookend. I think it's just some kind of like cutout because it's too, it's too leany leany uh, to be a bookend. So, put that right there. All right. So that appears to be it. So let's see what was all up in this box. So everybody got a print, uh, but it looks like there were a couple of different prints. There was a Thanos print um, done by a gentleman named Logan, Logan Pack, and then this um, Battle Green Lantern print done by Blake Henriksen. And if you got a red one-up card, you got a variant on uh, one of these two uh, prints as well. So. Uh, these are numbered and signed and everything like that. So there was a variant on these uh, that was available uh, if you got the red one up. And then everybody got the authentic uh, Alien Resurrection wardrobe card, which is very, very cool. I'm guessing it's the same piece of wardrobe, like everybody got like a jacket piece of some sort. Uh, let's see. Everybody got the Mars Space Sand. I wonder if people got different colors. This doesn't really show this because this shows red, but I wonder if ever anybody got different colors. But I got pink, NBD, no big deal. Kind of like it. Uh, everybody got the Star Trek: The Next Generation badge and rank pin. So yeah, I was right. This is like the badge from the Starship Enterprise. These are die struck from a sheet of copper. So I was uh, double right, and uh, they are individually hand polished. These are cosplay quality. Uh, so hey, listen, I don't know jack about space and Star Trek and Star Wars, and I got this right, so I will consider that a victory. And then everybody got to the pin, uh, but it looks like everybody uh, got a different pin. Somebody, some people got the Groot True pin, and others got a Rocket Raccoon Love pin. So that's why it says True Love right there. Um, and then if you got a green one-up card, you got the black and gold variant. Um, but I like this one. Uh, same thing with the chunk one from last month. I like this regular colored one um, uh, a lot. This is a really cool pin, so I'm happy to have gotten this. Uh, there was also an option if you got a gold star, you won an autographed comic book, um, uh, Superman, Green Lantern, or Infinity War, uh, and others. Um, and it was signed by, I'm guessing, one of the artists or the uh, penner, the... the uh, you know, the writers of that particular comic book. So that was in this month's box. So really there were a lot of different options. Very few people got the same exact box um, because there were a lot of different one-ups and then that gold star. Um, so there were some really great options. They went above and beyond. I'm not a big fan of any of these things. I really, really liked Guardians of the Galaxy, but I'm not a big space fan. Um, Green Lantern is probably my, my least favorite Justice League person, um, but I, I dig all this stuff. This is really great stuff, um, and it's well worth uh, what I paid for. This Darth Vader thing. I'm not a I'm not a Star Wars fan, but this Darth Vader thing is awesome, and I'm definitely keeping this around because this thing is super cool. So that is it for this month's fan box. Uh, again, I want to thank you all for watching. Uh, if you have not yet uh, signed up for Bandbox, I really really think you should. They are just crushing it, and they're great people. They watch these videos that people put out. They support the people 
um, that are making these videos, they're buying their boxes. Uh, the owner, the guy who runs the company, um, he is uh, out there, he is involved, he's on the message boards uh, in the, on the Bad Box community, he's you know, talking to people, he's, he's, he's getting the feedback firsthand. And when you have the guy who's running the show getting feedback firsthand, you're always going to get um, you're always going to get a win, and these products are always going to be great. So next month's theme is crazy, um, and I'm being told that there's some Joker stuff in there, um, and uh, so that's going to be a really great theme. I think it's a different theme than anything we've seen before. Uh, you know, 80s and space and this and that, but crazy is a cool idea for a theme. And I think it's something that the Bandbox guys are going to absolutely annihilate with awesomeness. So uh, let me know what you thought of this box. If you want any information about Bandbox, uh, you can get it in the description below. And I will share links to uh, some of those other channels that uh, also got a little bit of love from the Bandbox in the links below. And uh, please go ahead and give me a comment. Hit me with a subscribe. Hit me up on the YouTube. Or I'm not, excuse me, I'm on the YouTube. You're watching on the YouTube. Hit me up on Twitter at TV Chips. Uh, Facebook at TV Chips. Let me know what you thought, if you have any questions, um, and uh, what you think of Bandbox. Also, what is your favorite item? Because uh, this box is totally cool. And if you got one of something different than the jacket, uh, let me know. I'd love to see that. So, um, so yeah, that's Bandbox for this month. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, this has been an awesome box. I can't wait for next month. I will see you then. So uh, everybody's getting a specific item, and one of the items that uh, is in this box uh, is an upgrade. There's a limited quantity of them, and uh, I received one of those limited quantities. So we'll see what that is in a moment. Uh, next month, oh, I'm sorry, uh, another thing that Bandbox does is they give, do a giveaway of a, like an extra awesome item. If you post a picture of yourself uh, with your favorite item from this month's box, and use the hashtag the band box. Uh, they uh, will be giving away. This looks like it's a Stan Lee signed uh, Ronan the Accuser 16 by 20 photograph. So uh, the winner will be announced in a couple of weeks. Um, so if you have this box, if you haven't already done that, so go ahead and um, tweet your favorite item uh, hashtag uh, the band box so you have a chance to win this because that is got to be pretty awesome. It's uh, Stan Lee is. Uh, you know, he's Stan Lee, so uh, that's that. And then uh, a little uh, straight out of Compton. Uh, this is for everybody like the day. Just listen to what I'm saying and do it and take a chance. I put my hand up on your hip. When I dip, you dip, we dip. You put your hand up on my hip. When you dip, I dip, we dip. I put my hand up on your hip. Bam! Bam! The July BAM box. BAM box. Uh, and if it's anything like the June box, this box is going to be incredible. This has instantly become my favorite box. Um, I've been a big fan of it. Uh, and then I got my first box last month and I absolutely loved it. Um, I'm a huge, huge, huge supporter of the BAM box people. And guys, they are so appreciative of the people who do these videos and, and whatnot. Um, I will put a picture on the thing. Uh, they actually it, it put a picture of little old me. Little old me with like 40 some subscribers. Uh, they put me on their website. My video uh, featured on their website in videos. Such an amazing honor um, to be included. And with uh, my friends over at Comic Trips and uh, uh, the uh, fine folks at uh, Nerd Therapy. Uh, those guys are awesome channels. Uh, you should check them out as well. Wedged in between those two uh, was, was my video, and I am so incredibly honored, so incredibly grateful. Uh, I'm not getting anything from Bambox. I'm not receiving any kind of 
a plug to to talk about how great they are or anything like that. I bought this box with my own money, um, and uh, I love it. And uh, they are so supportive of the people that uh, do this. Uh, so I can't even begin to thank them enough. Uh, the things it's done for my channel, my viewers, uh, my subscribers doubled. Uh, I got like triple the amount of viewers on that video that I've gotten uh, that I had gotten already uh, just because of their support, and I appreciate every uh, ounce of it. Um, so uh, if you have not checked this box out yet, you really should. Comes uh, Smart Post Economy, which takes about a week or so to get. This box arrives within two days, um, and that is, I mean, that's just another thing that they're doing. They're really shows how much they care. They're even making sure that we're getting these boxes as quickly as possible. Um, I was away last week, uh, and my box has uh, been sitting in my room for the last week. Uh, I was away at a summer camp for uh, adults with muscular dystrophy that I do every year, and um, uh, I, I just, uh, I've, been, I've been eager to get into this thing, so let's go ahead and do it. Uh, I also got another box, and so you'll be able to look for another video coming shortly. So let's see what's in this one's bam box. Oh, we got some cards. Let's see. Let's see what these cards have to say. It looks like I got one of the precious one-ups. Uh, it looks like I got a gold mushroom one-up or a yellow, yellow, excuse me, I got a yellow one-up card. Uh, the yellow one-up cards mean that one of my items has been upgraded. Uh, next month's box is probably already on the verge of being sold out and uh, there's still a couple weeks to go uh, on that one. So um, definitely uh, want to say thank you and want to just once again say you should really subscribe to this box. I haven't even opened this box and I already think that uh, it's going to be amazing just because of what they put into it, the time and effort that goes into these boxes. Um, far and away, whatever they're doing there, they're doing it right and, um, and I love it. So this is the July box. The theme is galaxy or galactic or something along those lines it's all space stuff um i'm worried that this is going to be a little bit above my head because i'm not a big space person i don't uh i don't really get into space too much so hopefully uh hopefully i will know everything that is in this box and not look like a complete moron so let's get this box opened up also i want to point something else out this box came two-day mail all of these other subscription boxes, every single one of them, 